No, of, of course I, I'm disappointed. Whenever there's a, an election and Labour doesn't uh, win, uh, I, I've lived in London my entire life. Uh, this seat's never been uh, Labour since I've been alive, uh, including in 1997 during the Tony Blair landslide and the subsequent by-election a few months later, or 2001, 2005, or subsequent uh, elections. So, of course, I'm disappointed uh, we didn't uh, win. Uh, I welcome the 7-8% swing to uh, uh, Labour. I'm quite clear, though. The policy to expand the ultra-low emission zone is the right one. It was a difficult decision to take. But just like nobody would accept drinking dirty water, why accept dirty air? We know the ULIS has cleaned uh, the air in central London by almost 50%. Uh, what, what about those in outer London? And the point is, the government's given financial supports to other cities in the country in their clean air zones. Why not London? You are, aren't you? Critics say you're trying to push this through without wider backing, without a suitable scrappage scheme. This policy is trying to run before it can walk, isn't it? Well, what this policy has led to in central London and then inner London uh, is a reduction in the toxicity by almost 50 per cent in central London a further 20% less poison in, in, in London. There are a third fewer children being admitted to hospital with asthma uh, attacks. We've seen a massive reduction in carbon emissions. So four million Londoners are benefiting. What about the other five million in outer London where there is the largest number of premature deaths? The 10 boroughs with the largest number of premature deaths are in outer London. It's the poorest Londoners, the least likely to own a car, suffer the worst consequences. So look, we've got a scrappy scheme because we've been listening. £110 million in the scrappage scheme. Because I'm listening, we've widened the eligibility, so every single family in London who receives child benefit is now eligible for uh, support. Every business that employs up to 50 people can now receive support, and every charity can now receive uh, support. We're going to carry on listening, carry on making sure we monitor the uh, situation. But the choice is simple. Do we kick the can down the road to clean up the area in London, or do we take action?